Well, I'm back out of the water because I wanted to check what's going on with the electrolysis I had like nearly two years ago. And it doesn't look too good. Just kidding. Everything looks great. Everything looks fine. There's no new electrolysis. Um, I went to Ram Marine and they took me out of the water with a crane and uh, put Carl on the hard and I just scraped the, the dirt off his bottom and then I inspected the, the underwater hull and everything looks good. The spots, there's like no more paint coming off, just tiny little bits but in those, you know, there's no holes or anything. Um, there's a tiny little bit of eaten away but it's so small and not a lot it's just because there's bare aluminum in that spot and it all looked good so all I had to do was to uh, prep those little open spots on where there is aluminum showing and uh, etch prime them and prime them to uh, sand the hull underneath the waterline and I did wet sanding with um, 80 grit paper and after that I painted the anti-fouling and Carl looked nice and shiny again. <laughs> I put a little green white spot pirates line just between the black and the white and it actually looks pretty cool. Well, and also I had been thinking what I was going to do about looks a little bit. I know there's not, you know, I didn't want to spend a lot of money or a lot of, nor a lot of time on it, but I thought if I can keep it fairly low, um, then I might do something. And I had to buy some paint anyways because I wanted to paint the anti-skit on, on the deck. So I bought some paint, I just bought a little bit and I made a trial on the existing paint just to see if it was compatible. And when I saw that it was compatible, 
I uh, took the grinder with the paint stripping, stripping disc that I used also for um, taking the bottom paint off the two years ago. And I, I cleaned the bits um, above the waterline, just underneath the rail, the open aluminum bits. So I cleaned those and prepped them, put acetone on them, and put three layers of primer, yeah, well, etch primer, and then three layers of primer on it. And then I sanded the whole sides with the, with the sander and put a layer of well, I put some white on the on the on the prime spots before, like two, three layers of white, and then I put a whole layer of white on the on the whole side. And um, after that, I went with the fine sandpaper. I think it's like 400 or something. Um, some wet sanding over the over the one white layer, and then I put another white layer, and he looked pretty fancy. And then when everything was finished, I um, I added a little tiny. Bit as well, um, Irma from uh, Weltefrieden in Hamburg. She, you know, she's the one that did the the Carl stickers for my boat, and she made me um, this green pirate pin that I have in my White Spot Pirates logo because I wanted to put it in the, in the on the bow of the boat. So that was the last thing I did today, and I think it looks pretty wicked. Carl looks pretty cool. He looks like a tough boy, and well, it's about time to go back in the water in about half an hour and I'm really looking forward to it because it's never really fun being on the heart and I actually was getting a bit loony up here um, but yeah it's time to go back and we'll be swimming very soon again and then we're off to Kayoki Maru to change Carl's rigging oh man, this boy is getting so fancy a bit more about that next week. always here, always on the right when I come in. <laughs> I've been looking around for taking everything apart since an hour. Oh, no way. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's the other right. <laughs> Goodbye, Marina! <laughs>